Easter candy, Easter candy, Easter candy, Easter candy. I wonder if there's anything in this rabbit. Or is it just chocolate? Oh, weird. It's got a hole in it. And oh! Look at that. Do you think that's because they injected it with something? Let's see. Nope. It's all chocolate. Oh, Lordy. Mmm. Happy Good Friday, everybody. Nope. It's Good Friday. And I want you to have a happy one. Also, it's apparently Passover. So finally, I have another excuse to try my pronunciation. Chag Samech. I just lost all the Jewish people. Mmm. I should have had that. Mmm. I should have eaten that before I started. Sorry. Mmm. Here's to you. It's late, yo. It's 7 Eleven. No, it really is 7 Eleven. 7 Eleven p.m. And the current temperature, with the sun barely in the air, 57 degrees. It's supposed to rain tomorrow. If it rains, I will not do yard work. If it doesn't rain, I may still not do yard work. We shall see. <sighs> yes. I promised that I would uh, catch up on my comments, and I really need to catch up on my comments because next week I'll be working in a different building and away from this camera, and I will not make a special trip out here just to record videos for you. So I'm off next week as far as you're concerned. I'll be in reruns. There will not be a guest host. In fact, the reruns will have to be of your own choice because I'm not going to repost stuff I've already posted. Don't be silly. But before we do that, let's do this. Comments going back to Wednesday where I was talking about Pepsi Next and the Pepsi Next experience. I actually talked about that earlier, but Wednesday is when Mike responded to it. He says... I finally figured out the entire reason for Pepsi Next. A 20 ounce bottle has the magical 100 calories on the label to sucker those in who don't like diet things, but have been trained to look for 100 calorie options. Does it actually say that on the label? Interesting. We do not yet have 20 ounce bottles of Pepsi Next, so I can't make that determination. I tried one on Tuesday morning and was disgusted by it. Disgusted? Really? Well. I admit, I don't have a spina palate as, as you, so I don't know. It seems like it has nothing but aftertaste. See, I didn't I didn't get an aftertaste at all. But again, I may be so used to diet soda that what may be an aftertaste for other people is just something I don't notice at all. And yet, Mike says, I'll stick with my Coke Zero when having non-water drinks. So you are in the diet arena as well. Hmm. Well, it bears further investigation, I suppose. I have not had a, a can of Pepsi Next since then, I don't think. There are a couple in the fridge, but I haven't been having a lot of soda at home actually at all. I'm going to fix that. Scotty Flamingo says, I am dead on in my post bra and Mania reviews. Thank you. I still feel like I'm the only person who's reminded everybody that Seamus is Triple H's guy, but... I'm sure it's all over the net, and I just don't go to those places. I don't do a lot of wrestling reading outside of the W. Although I, I will read uh, the Mask Man stuff because he's been so kind to me, and I feel like I need to be up on what he's talking about. Although I haven't read the Brian Daniel piece. The problem is they're so long. I know, I'm, I'm complaining about long stuff, but i got to set some, some time aside. It's like trying to read observers. you got to set some time aside to do it. Not that I do that, because I'm not a subscriber. You know what I'm talking about. So you don't have to keep talking wrestling. Sky Flamingo continues. Do you read any comics? If so, what? No, I don't. What a letdown, I know. The last comics I read were when I subscribed to a newspaper. And I currently do not subscribe to a newspaper. And that's not what you mean anyways, because those are comic strips, and you're talking about comic books, which I do not read any. I thought about it, picking it up, but it's just one of those hobbies I can't afford. 
unlike all my other hobbies that are sucking away all my money. Chris asks, what is the most difficult thing you've had to draw on draw something so far? It's my own fault. I got Hercules and got cocky and thought I could draw a wrestler with a chain around his neck, and that would be an easy three coins. And it turns out I can't draw a chain because uh, the fingers on the phone don't work so well. And I doubt that Mark knew what I was talking about anyway. Although, I haven't asked. Mark will have to report whether or not he had a, oh yeah, one of those moments. I don't know, it was, it was really the worst thing, easily the worst thing I've done in Draw Something. Every time I get dubstep as a three coin option, I'll X out of the program so I can get new words without wasting a bomb. This is not cheating. I didn't know you could do that. Interesting. I have not used a bomb on words yet. <laughs> Excuse me. If you want to draw dubstep, what you do is you draw a musical note, and then you put the international no sign around it. But then you have to get someone who hits dubstep and understands uh, you. I've, uh, I've, I've warmed up to, dub, to dubstep. I don't think it's that bad now. I would not classify it as not music. But yeah, I wouldn't know how to draw it either. I guess I would try writing Skrillex on the screen. I always feel that's cheating when you're putting words on the screen. But on the other hand, who cares? <laughs> and uh, we all want to get coins anyway, so... I guess that's part of what makes Draw Something so appealing is that it's just easy enough and if it isn't you can still cheat and nobody cares unless you get some righteous person as your partner which I have not yet I'm playing with five people right now I think if you want to play Draw Something with me my name is CRZ, uh, CRZ Net CRZ Net don't put a dot in there like I just tried to do Does the use of words in Draw Something make you wish they'd hurry up and come out with a password game app? I don't know. I, I play Draw Something more than I should anyway, and I don't think I need to be looking for other games. I mean, I never played Angry Birds, and hopefully I never will. I don't know, but maybe I should. I, spent, I waste a lot of time on those Facebook games, too. Really, all that gaming time, I should be out uh, earning money and paying off the house. But I'm lazy, and I like games. Oh well. Greg watched five videos in one sitting. Why? That's a lot of CRZ talk at a time, but I'm caught up now. Any Moxie in your area yet? I am told that there are some wholesalers who will sell Moxie, but I am not a business and cannot avail myself of wholesalers, so it's only a rumor. But I still have about half of a case left. I got a case for Christmas many years ago, and I've been meeting them out one by one, and I still have about half of them. And as old as they are, they still taste great. Must be that real sugar. Ryan Anderson's Three Point Magic says, like the shirt. Thank you. How'd you know I was going to wear this shirt today? I like it, too. It's one of my, you know, these kind of stripes make me look uh, skinny, right? Oops. Sorry. Pull the pants up. Oh, you mean the shirt I wore yesterday. My 1997 Craftwork Tour shirt. Yeah, I like that one, too. Thanks for the comment. A uh, comment I ignored from Wednesday from Jins, who I wasted time to figure out who it was. It, it's Dr. Pepper MD. I mean, Mr. Botho. I mean, he doesn't want you to know he's all those three people, but he is. He was talking about my work's energy, and he thought that maybe this number was the date. Also it's a uh, you can't tell but it's a two in that recycle symbol not a one. Uh, and it's too muddled for me to figure out what it stands for. Anyway, that's more than I ever want to talk about. I may have to avail myself of some of these next week. I have to show up at 8.30. Ugh, five days in a row. Ugh, it's not gonna happen. Well, it'll have to happen. Because I enjoy working. I don't enjoy working. I, I enjoy getting paid to work. I kind of enjoy working. I enjoy working more when I don't get here at 8.30, though, that's for sure. There were some Facebook comments. I'm going to ignore them. It's because it's my own fault. But you know what you said, and you know what I meant. But if you, uh, actually, if you go to my wall on Facebook... A friend of mine from high school, Andy, posted one of my KZM mixtapes that he still has 20 years later, which is amazing. 
And I, honestly, I, I didn't know, Andy, that you and I were still talking 20 years ago. I thought we'd given up on each other by then, but that's pretty cool. And that playlist is that holds up. I'll have to see if I have a copy of that myself, or if not, I'll have to try to reconstruct it on Spotify or something, because I don't know why. I actually have a case full of Kazem tapes, but I don't think I have that one. I think that's before I started making copies of stuff I handed out so that I have a copy for myself. But that's it, right? Anybody talk about anything else? No? Okay. I'm over 10 minutes? Okay. Like I said, out all next week. I uh, may be here Friday, but don't count on it. Uh, we're going to miss, what, two home games? Three home games? Yeah. There's six home games left. Half of them are next week. How about that? But I'm not going to talk about the Timberwolves or Otto might stop watching. Actually, all of you should stop watching because I'm going to end it right now. Thanks for sticking with me for another week. Hard to believe we've done 67 of these. This is 67, right? It is. No signs of stopping, although I do promise to try and do better than I did before later. Thanks. I love you. I will see you in about 10 days. So long.